Whew, having a clean office, you guys, is one of like the best feelings ever. It probably feels that way because I had it pretty dirty for like two months straight. But I'm here to put in some work today. We have to print out some film. I just finished burning some screens. We have like three jobs that are due today. So nothing too crazy. Definitely stuff that we can handle. Uh, I went down the street to a local business here. I went down the street to drop off some samples here at a business and I hope that they order a lot of shirts and they do like electrical wire work. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Can you guys notice something different about this back part of the office right now? I'll just tell you guys. So the guys that were in here last week working on the carpet, they broke my glass the huge glass that I had right there and they reported it to the owners of this place I'm not sure if they're gonna pay for it but if they do I'll be happy if not it is what it is my wife didn't really like it too much because when Cassidy would come in she would get too close to it and she was scared that it would fall on her so either way I'm okay with that thing being gone if I get paid for it it's just gonna be a plus and uh, we're in here today to get some work done we had a great weekend. I really hope that you guys had a great weekend too. So we're in here today to put in some work. We have a lot of jobs that need to go out. We have a hat job. We need 75 koozies to print. We have a 12-piece uh, color changing job that needs to go out. And we also have to set up some artwork to get it approved for a 121 piece that needs to go out by Friday, which shouldn't be a problem. And we also need to place some orders for shirts that need to get printed tomorrow. We have a lot of things going on. Earlier today, I went and dropped off some samples to a company. Uh, my friend works at that company. It's not the American truck, it's a different one. And they wanted those, uh, I don't know if you guys seen them. They're kind of like bandanas that you just put over your head and they kind of have like masks on their face. They order some blank ones because they really like the material and they wanted their company printed on the side of their face. So I went ahead and printed those samples for free for them. It was just two of them. And that was that was cool. So I hope to get that job. And if that happens, they're just down the street. So that's going to be convenient. And that's it. So I printed the film out for the hats that I'm printing. Whenever I print out film for hats, I like to do two sizes. Because I don't want to come back and have to print another one when this strip of film, it's, it's already gone anyways. So I'm going to go ahead and figure out which one I want. I already have the screen coded for this, so all I have to do is figure out which one I want and then go ahead and burn it so we can get that going. Ah, let me turn off this on cooler. Okay, so that's how we figure out what size we want for the hats. I decided to go with the bigger one. So let's go ahead and get the day started. I'm about to go burn that screen for the hats. And while that's burning, I'm gonna go ahead and set these two up so we can get them going. And then we can get back to the computer. We can uh, give a call to AST so we can pay them the invoice, the open invoices that we have. And then also our accountant because we got an invoice for uh, filing for the last three quarters. And we also have to pay the uh, Department of Revenue tomorrow so there's a lot of pain going on there's a lot of work going on and we're gonna knock it out i did shoot today's video a couple of times today and i really didn't like it too much so this is gonna be the one that we're doing we have a lot of jobs set up that we finished last week so we need to break all of this stuff down jeremiah texted me earlier so he's on his way and we're gonna figure out what needs to come down we need to figure out who's gonna reclaim because we have a lot of jobs coming in this week and that's it, so let's go ahead and get going. Okay, so I just finished separating the shirts. They get the black ink and the ones that get the white ink. Uh, it's kind of crazy sometimes, so you guys need to pay attention and go through the email, check out all the details, and make sure you get everything right. So that's done. Uh, we also have to get this one we did some last week or the week before. They're reversible jerseys. The customer wanted to add one more jersey, so we have to do that one also today. I got the hats ready to go. 
and the screen has just done burning for the hats so as soon as that dries up we're gonna set it up we're gonna get those going we got this ready so we're gonna set the screens up and we're gonna knock these out today so we can get out of here oh my goodness so I totally overexposed my hat screen job that I had so I had to reclaim it and we're just gonna coat it again while we work on these other two jobs I'm just gonna wait till this is dry coated and then reburn it so I normally burn everything at five minutes and 30 seconds because this hat screen has less emulsion I think more lights gets through a lot easier so I'm gonna bring this one down to maybe four minutes and 30 seconds to expose it I hope that that's the right number. If it is, I'm gonna write it down on my wall because I know I'm gonna forget. And <clears throat> hopefully it works out, it kinda sucks.